The Factory 5 818 sports car is our newest design. The idea behind the 818 is a fun-to-drive, lightweight, mid-engine sports car. It comes in two variants, the 818S, the street model, and the 818R, which is the track-focused race model. The 818 is engineered to be built. It can go from kit to finished car in your garage in less time than any other Factory 5. When we launched the company, it was, if you got a Mustang and $9,900, you can build a Factory 5. And that launched the company. And that was our wingman. That, those are the people who built Factory 5 and enabled us to grow. Well, when we looked at the 818, we said, hey, let's come full circle. Let's go back to our wingman. Let's go back to a guy that maybe he doesn't have as much money as he has skills. And, and let's make a car that can be built kit that's 10 grand but can be finished for 15. Once the design goal was set that we had to build and complete this car for 15 grand or less, it required using more parts from a donor car. So we're still doing the frame, the chassis, suspension, body and all that, but we had to use more parts from a Subaru. If you have the 818 kit and a 2002 to 2007 Subaru WRX or normally aspirated Impreza, you have everything you need to build your car. The 818 was designed to be a global car. That means it can be built in either left-hand or right-hand drive configurations. And the tough, affordable Subaru running gear is available all over the planet. The 818 uses composite body panels that are gel-coated and don't have any seams, so there's no paintwork required. Minimal bodywork means minimal cost. The 818 is our, is our largest challenge to date, and if you look at the, the growth of the company, the growth of the company really has been a function of the integration of technology and the integration of really powerful technology. So now with the 818, everything's coming full circle. The design of the frame, chassis suspension, bill of materials, now surfacing and molding and mold making and plug making, all in one massive universe. The result of that's going to be a car that's easy to build, that will perform at supercar levels, and that's, that's priced at a really good budget that a guy at home can afford. Factory 5 does a great job using SOLIDWORKS to design these cars. You know, they're leveraging the accuracy they can get out of the 3D model. So, you know, it's one thing to make things look great in 3D and, and actually get built, but Jim and Jesper and the team here are doing finite element analysis to make sure that these structures are sound and safe for people to purchase and then build these cars. They take the results directly from the computer and can feel confident that they can go into production knowing they've got high factor safety built into here and the customer is going to get a great product. Um, we've designed uh, an S model which is full street, full windshield, pair of seats, regular interior, and then in our model which is a low windscreen, full roll cage. We've done a lot of driving on the track uh, of both the R and the S model. And the, the goal all along was for the S model to be track capable right off the bat because I think that makes the car fun to drive even on the street. Doesn't mean you're at, at, at racetrack pace, but if the car is capable of, of that, you feel it in the suspension, you feel it in the handling. The car wants to go around a corner. I'm shocked at, at where the performance envelope of the car is. It's a really high performing car. And it makes sense because weight's the enemy. 818-818 stands for the number of kilograms the target weight in the design goal was. 1,800 pounds is, is 818 kilograms. Having knocked the weight down so low, it's just an edgy sports car. The 818 is the proof of the expression that a man's reach should exceed his grasp. I mean, we really did, with the design goals, put a reach we thought was beyond our grasp, and it turned out we nailed it.